I don't know. I'd be kind of happy that it was a close match. I mean, I'm happy it was a close match. I'm not happy that, like... Like... Bro, they looked at me, right? Here's what happened. You guys saw something different than what I than what I saw, okay? Here's mean? what happened to me. me. Listen, 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 listen. No, no, no. You were looking at me. You were looking at me. Let, let me let me explain to you, okay? Okay, okay. So match starts, right? Right? <laughs> I'm like, okay, guys, let's do this. Let's go, right? Get on the point. I touch the point. The point turns into this like this jail cell. This this the circle of <laughs> <Jail>. death. <laughs> The circle of death, okay? And this and circle of death. And you have to go on there. <laughs> this man. I, 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 no, no, no. L no listen. Listen. I was forced to endure. No, listen. The circle of death blazing with fire and explosions. Everything exploding around you. Nothing you can do about it. You're being told you're being healed, but your, your life is just going down like butter. Not no, going down and melting like butter. It, and it's not even just like like butter. It's butter like it takes a little second, right? Butter takes a little a little a little second. A little second gotta heat it up, right? My junk got like Thanos snapped away. No, not even Thanos. He has to collect all the little emeralds. No, it just disappeared, bro. It instant transmission, bro. And, and what you know what happened then? You touch that little that little circle of death. And all you see is gray. You know why? Because you died the second you touched it. That was a very extensive. But no, that's not all. Torture. Listen, that's not all. I had to endure that throughout the entire match, bro. So as soon as I get out, right, and I and I met with this circle of death, there are times, yeah, when I could stand it, but I could touch it just a little bit. To where instead of like me touching it and dying like I'm in lava instantly, I touched it and it was like a hot branding iron going up my behind. So I go right. And I try to confront the problem directly, right? The tank right in front of me. <clears throat> ah, ah, I want him. So I go over there, right? I'm like, hey, what's up? I see you trying to burn me. You know, torture me to death. And it's been working out for you so far. But now it's going to change, bro. Now it's going to change. And so I pull out my weapons, my little biscuit, my rocket launcher, you know. And I start hitting him with it. But uh, something happened in him, you see. I don't know what happened. I don't know if he, like, inhaled some some testosterone or, or, or steroids or, or if he came from Baki or something. Because that man, like, turned Super Saiyan instantly. And he turned around, he set me and my whole, like, mech on fire. Which shouldn't even be possible, bro. This mech is made out of, like, some type of metal. I don't know. Think about how hot that is. Think about how hot that is, guys. That's how much I was being tortured. So, he turned around, he did that to me, right? Right? Then out of nowhere, right? Right? A little gremlin can dressed in a pirate costume. I'm serious, I'm not crazy. A little gremlin dressed in a pirate costume came. And what he did was so embarrassing. He, he took a little bomb, right? Like three little bombs. And he said, I'm a gig. He, he said, can you hold these for me? And I'm trying to be a nice little guy, right? So so I said, okay, what is it? And he ran away from me. And I said, huh? And it exploded in my hand. And then he took one while I was laid out on the ground suffering and shoved it in my throat. And he put it in there, and I exploded right on the circle of death. That okay. that wasn't that wasn't a game of paladins, bro. That was that was a war zone. That was Chicago. That was Detroit. That was, that was Brazil. <laughs> My God. So much information just in this live. So much subscribe getting blown up. <laughs> It's like someone telling me, like, oh, my life flashed before my eyes while getting Genju slashed. It did, and did. Hey, but you know what, though? I got my ult, right? Not that, mmm, my ult will change everything. And it did. I killed three people, right? I killed three people on the ult. I killed the tank and some other people who just didn't matter. But, besides the point, I killed them, right? And as soon as I did that, I don't know what happened. 
someone like put out like a hidden Assassin's Creed, like when Assassin's Creed mode it put out a hidden blade or something. And they took me from behind instantly as soon as I took down all their teammates. And I don't know, but as soon as that happened and I saw that screen, gray screen, one by one I saw my comrades die to that one person with the I hidden blade. Like a paladin veteran describing your story to watch a freaking kid who just got paladin. What the fuck? <laughs> All I asked was why are you so upset? <laughs> I'm, I'm answering your question. It's not a story. It's 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 an experience. It no, I'm like telling you. <laughs> Freaking wrote a whole freaking Wattpad novel of your adventures on Paladin in like this Vietnam setting where you're, like, you're crossing the, the trenches with Alex the freaking cross. Like Jesus. I get it, I get it. You, you could have just said, hey, we've had some tough matches. That match took everything. No, out. no, because it wasn't tough, bro. It wasn't tough. It was torture. It was torment. It was terrifying, okay? Oh, I probably know. You're, play you're playing an off tank against a person that basically has to put bombs on the point and you can't touch it. I know for full well that that's torture. Hell, even if you had a shield, it would have broken within five seconds anyway. So, you got uh, a mission yet? So. I'm on cyber missions. I've already loaded it. Yeah. He is. I have to go to my session. <laughs> what? Like, bro, you don't understand, man. You don't... What's the experience in Warzone? Dude, I know oh. I play ROM. I, I I know exactly how it feels to play an off tank against a bunch of people who basically make it so the second you look at the point, you just get die. I didn't just look at the point and get die, bro. I just wanted to admire it. <laughs> you can admire it from behind that wall is what they meant. <laughs> bro, that wasn't even a wall. It wasn't I'm just back. a wall. It was a ring of fire of death and I'm not gonna lie, you would do like a ring of fire. Like, like there were so many explosions and so many fire bombs around. It looked like everything was on fire. Why 